All right, welcome to basic circuitry, basic electronics, if you will. Um, let's go through the parts and then let's get right into it. Okay, so you've got in front of you this uh, simple circuit board that we have here, uh, electronics board, I guess is a better name for it. It's got everything from uh, control resistor knobs to light sensors to uh, momentary switches to switches, uh, LEDs, everything on here, a little blower motor. Uh, we also have a little foam ball, just put that there in the little place in the blower motor, and some batteries that are in the battery pack, some white shorter wires and some green longer wires and the actual project book. Okay, so there we have all of our parts and let's get right into it. To earn this Tech 2, you will do 10 of the 25 projects. They're all fun and they only just take a few moments for each one to do. <coughs> Excuse me. It'd be interesting if you did all 25, but, uh, but I'm gonna do uh, number one for you so you understand how it works. Probably do the first couple so you get how the whole program works. Now, uh, in the instruction book here, you can see here on this camera, that it shows you the actual electronics diagram for it. And this is what electrical engineers use, are these diagrams. Now it knows that you're not an electrical engineer, so it also then shows you um, the wiring sequence up here, okay? And then it has a little bit of directions on, on how it all works. So you can, number, you can do it with just the numbers or you can actually use the symbols as well because each one of these on the board has a corresponding electronics symbol to it and you can follow that. So. Uh, one word of warning, uh, I'm going to just uh, to put, um, uh, to, to attach these, I'm going to give you, the, show you how to attach them, then I'm going to give you the warning. Okay, so to attach this wire, I just take this little spring, I, I bend it over to the side, and I put it in there, and now I've attached uh, to the, um, looks like that's the negative side of the battery, and now I'm going to attach another one here to the positive side. Okay, so I have positive and negative uh, on the battery. Never, ever, ever put positive and negative together without running it through a light. Like if I touch it on the, uh, the LED light, it lights up. But never put them together. It will short circuit the battery and then the battery will start to fry and that's actually kind of dangerous, okay? So I know you're maybe tempted and curious and there's nothing wrong with curiosity, but I'm gonna solve that right now. This is one of those things you do not wanna put those together, okay? It's low voltage, you can hold on to both of them. Nothing's gonna to happen to you, it's only three volts. but. It would just be bad for this, the whole, all the capacitors and everything in here if you ever just put uh, positive and negative together without running it through something. Like don't, don't put them on a switch or anything like that where they go into each other because that would wreck the batteries and I'm gonna know exactly what you did. <laughs> okay, so, so now that we got that out of the way. Okay, so let's, let's talk about how to wire this up. So you can see here I've got a wiring diagram and it says connect two to 14. So I find two, which is on the battery, and 14, which is on the main switch, so a, a long wire is probably good for that. So let me go ahead and connect that. And then the next thing is 13 to four. There's four coming off the blower motor here. So let me just um, connect that. Okay, and then to 13, good. And you can see I've already got a wire in there, so you gotta kinda of be careful to make sure that other wire doesn't pop out. And then one, to three, this number one goes over here to the blower motor, three. Okay, good. And um, is that, yeah, I think that's, that's everything, right? Yeah, okay, so it says uh, complete all things, switch on the main switch, the blower is on, and you should see the ball float. Okay, let's switch it on. Okay, there, and it's gone, but there. We floated the ball for a moment, okay? It should maybe stay a little more steady there. But anyhow, that is as simple as it is. You see that only took me just a few seconds to complete that first project. That's why you will do 10 out of here. Maybe even do the full 25 if you want. Uh, that would be really cool. And so what you do is when you complete a project, you just hold it up to your um, camera on your, on your MacBook there, use photo booth and just take a picture, you know, just show me the circuit. So you will send me 10 photos with your little smiling face next to your circuit um, of your project. So I see all 10 of your projects and then I can look at the photo and make sure that everything is wired correctly. And uh, just name, your, name each one, uh, like I would name this photo blower, uh, floating ball, or name it experiment one, you know, whichever way you want to go on that. But that's as simple as it is. You're gonna learn some really cool things with um, electronics here with this, with this uh, basic electronics board. Okay, have fun.